Well, from successful festivals to a potential new national park and major community improvements, Macon is on the move. 41 NBC's Fiona King reports on the annual State of the Community Address. It's a great day being in Macon County. Tuesday's State of the Community Luncheon was packed with information. The key message, though, Macon is booming. Visit Macon says events like the Cherry Blossom Festival and the Christmas Lights Extravaganza made a $12.9 million economic impact. And that success is providing a smooth pathway for future businesses. It's so much easier to recruit businesses to a community that is experiencing so much momentum and positive change. Here at the Chamber, we want you to choose Macon. We want you to choose Macon for your business. We want you to choose Macon for your place to make your mark. We want you to live here. We want you to, to be a part of this. Tourism is also growing as well. A lot of eyes are on the Ogmogi Mounds. Mayor Lester Miller says we could soon have a national park right here in our backyard. We just had uh, Senator Ossoff in town uh, this last couple of days, and while he was here, we had a chance to kind of touch base with him, get an update, and... You know, it could happen any day. Uh, the bill's been basically approved by everyone. Everybody's on the same page, just waiting for it to drop and go through the process. Miller also spoke about a salary increase for those working in public safety and revamping East Macon. Elaine Lucas, the commissioner of District 3, says people of East Macon feel like they are still being neglected. Then I think a lot of times on the east side, people feel like neglect, they're neglected, that there's not a lot going on over there. And there is a need for an infusion of resources uh, on the east side of town. So I think help is on the way. Uh, Fiona King reporting there. Now, those East Macon improvements include the planned East Bank project across from the Coliseum. Mayor Miller also touched on other topics during his address, including removing blight, paving roads, and providing free mental health resources.